Hi, my name is Katie Shrewsbury and I'm a product manager for the Kitchen Clean Micro Enterprise. Kitchen Clean includes our dishwashers, our compactor, and our disposer lineups. And today, I'm joining you from AP35 in our beautiful product room to talk about disposers. Our disposers have two different mounting systems, the three bolt and the easy mount. There are two different methods we suggest using when you want to switch from a three bolt to an easy mount. First is completely uninstalling the three bolt and then following the instructions in our manual to install the easy mount. The second method is actually using our adapter kit and that method is preferred when you have corrosion or other issues that limit you from actually uninstalling the unit. The adapter kit comes in all of our models that do not come with a cord, so that's any model that ends in zero. To uninstall 3-bolt, you will need a T20 Torx as well as a large screwdriver to help unlock the existing disposal. You'll also need a flat head to loosen the snap ring. First, uninstall the existing disposer and set it on the sink flange. The extra weight will help when loosening the 3-bolt screws and removing the snap ring. Then you can get under the sink, use your Torx to loosen the screws and your flat head to uninstall the snap ring. The rest of the pieces should uninstall easily. In the scenarios where you have to use the existing three bolt sink flange, you can use the adapter provided as well as the step-by-step -step instructions in the manual. Next, you'll remove the gasket and locking ring from the easy mount sink flange. These will be assembled to the new adapter. You will then take the cushing mount and locking ring off the old disposer. You will then connect the cushion mount to the adapter. The first step is to rotate the locking ring, which separates the existing sink flange assembly from the Followed new disposer. Followed by the locking ring of the old disposer and then lastly, the locking ring of the new disposer. Now your adapter kit is assembled and you can attach it to your disposer. It's imperative that you rotate the lock all the way over to the edge. This is easier typically to do it under the sink when you have a little bit of pressure. Thanks so much for spending time with us today and I hope you found this content valuable. Please continue to send your questions and comments our way so we can create more content and help you sell more disposers. Have a great day.